Hey, welcome to the flashcard iPhone application demonstration. Just a quick uh, four minute video. Run you through the basics of the uh, flashcard application. Here's the icon. Uh, I'm using a simulator. It's an iPhone simulator. Runs on my uh, laptop. Allows me to make a movie. So a couple of the features uh, like shuffle and shake aren't available, but uh, they are available within the application. I just can't show them to you on the screen here. All right, the QA stands for question answer in uh, flashcard there. So we click on the icon, opens up. Come to the main menu here. A um, couple of options from here. I'll show you preferences real quick up front. It's kind of important. Um, you go to the website, www.flashcardqard.com. Sign up for a free account. Not going to use your email for spam or sell it or anything like that. It's just used for account information related to... Uh, your account for use with this application. Enter those, uh, enter that information in there. Set your shuffle sensitivity. It is very sensitive, so you want to knock it down a little bit. Uh, come to that in a second. Go back out to the main menu. All right, middle of the screen shows you. Uh, they're called card sets, and the card set that I've loaded now is one that I made. It's just uh, state capitals and birds. This shows you uh, how many categories it has, how many questions, when it was last updated. If I click on study cards, we'll go in there to study the state capitals and birds. Notice there were two categories. There's four in here. Uh, these two are always here, the all categories and the reset card set. Uh, if you want to just study all of them together, you can click on that category. And let's, we'll just go into capitals, so I'm going to click on that. It takes you in one out of 50 questions. To move through the cards, just swipe your finger from uh, right to left or left to right to go back through. If you want to see the answer, just tap, flips the question over. Uh, you can flag cards. Notice here I'll flag a few of them just for further review. And if I go back out, notice now we've got five categories. New one called flagged cards. If I click on that, it'll take me back to the three that I had flagged. As I unflag them, they go away and the category goes away. Uh, one other thing you can do, you can delete cards as you master the material help yourself whittle down what you're working on. Notice now it says 48 of the original 50 remain. If I click on reset card set, I get all my cards back. All right, now we'll show you the manage cards uh, area. This is where if you click on search, you can connect to our website. Right now it just grabs all of the questions. If I want to do a uh, keyword search, I can, uh, that's the name of the company I work for, I can put in ASA. It'll show me anything that, uh, that I had put in there uh, I've got some limitations and study guides for some uh, aircraft manuals. If I want to download one of these, I just click on it. And I already downloaded the uh, CR-7 one. I'll do the CR-200. It downloads it. It's not normally this quick when you're working on the iPhone network. It's, it's fairly fast, but right now I'm connected to a uh, T1, so it, it comes blazing through there. But uh, I click on that, click Load. It loads it. Notice now that we've got uh, CRJ-200 limitations. I'm going to go back to manage cards and to switch between cards you just come down here to downloads and notice there's the CR9 I was talking about if I click on that it loads that set um, a few of the other things in here top rated this just measures popularity how many times things have been downloaded the the application or the card set that's been downloaded the most receives uh, I think four or five stars and then it kinda scales down from there uh, I'm working on that uh, you can do featured if, if we select some card sets we like. I can make them featured to show up in here. If I go to my cards, these are card sets that I've uploaded. These are all the ones that I've worked on and contributed for uh, to share. So anybody can uh, can review these. Um, if I go back out, notice I had uh, selected the AR uh, ASA CR7 CRJ700 study guide. There's 32 categories, 348 uh, questions. I've tested this up to 4,000 questions. And you can see there are quite a few in here. Uh, a lot of good information. Very easy to create these card sets. Visit the website www.flashcard. That's F-L-A-S-H-Q-A-R-D.com. Thanks.